Hello everyone, well, my name is Chang Nguyen and my research topic is on explanation for time series classification under the supervision of uh, Dr. Shoshana Ephraim uh, at University College Dublin. So why time series classification? It is because time series classification is used in many critical human related tasks such as human activity recognition, sports science and medical application. Uh, for this task, explanation is often required and it is in the form of a saliency maps highlighting the important part of the time series that is critical for a classifier to make decision. Uh, the problem arises when we have a multiple method that provide different saliency map and they are not agreeing with each other. Um, one of the example is uh, what you can see in this uh, picture when we have three methods and all of them seems uh, different in highlighting the important part. And the, that is the, exactly ch the challenge that we want to tackle in this project. That is how to assess and objectively compare this explanation method. So what we do in this project, we come up uh, with a few aspects regarding to the explanation quality. And we choose the informativeness as the explanation quality that we want to tackle in this project. Uh, so basically, a more informative explanation often associated with uh, a higher capability of the method to influence the classifier to correctly identify a class. Uh, we devise an evaluation method and a metric to measure the inf informativeness of this method. How we do that? Uh, we approach that from the per perturbation approach. Uh, basically, we add noise to the um, to the subsegment of the time series and measure its importantness. Uh, with this, we can create an explanation-driven loss in accuracy kind of curve, and. Um, measure it with a metric. We detail the method and the metric in this uh, paper in which I include a link to the paper. Uh, and uh, that's it. I am happy to answer any question regarding to this topic. Thank you.